the larger healthcare um, projects that we undertake and we co-invest with other partners in are also terribly important in the way that they help empower women. My particular passion is that girls stay in school and one of the big things of the work we've been doing has been to keep girls in school. Building lavatory blocks, building latrines, building showers helps girls stay in school far longer than if those facilities are not available. My responsibility here is always take care of girls. When girls are in school, as soon as they start to have their monthly periods, they tend to stop going to school. If there are no latrines, no privacy, and frankly no facilities or um, sanitary products for them, the difficulties inherent in having a monthly period generally mean that girls tend to leave education. And one of the things about building lavatories, building showers, is to give them privacy, is to give them the option to stay in school for longer, to complete education. It's very important for them, even during that particular time. Also, they can just take a shower. So here we have 10 rooms for girls and two rooms for washrooms for girls. And although the girls have been able to come to school throughout the month, you're just giving people more ranges of choices for later life and that I think is very important. Working with women, freeing them from the bounds of female genital mutilation and what that is looking to do is to provide another way of marking the coming of age and something that the community buys into that becomes a real alternative rite of passage that is replacing the female genital mutilation. Kip Kellyan is an area that it's been highly prevalent in. The teachers are behind us, the headmasters and headmistresses of the schools are very supportive, the local chiefs and the local elders are supportive. And I think one of the key things with that is educating the older generations as much as the younger generation to make those choices. And it's a really significant thing about the um, ability of education to really change lives and to allow women to have more say and more control over their own lives.